So to wrap up our discussion on different research methodologies, we've covered three different groups of research. We've covered exploratory research, descriptive research, and causal research, and each serves its own purpose. If the goal is to generate questions, if you're in the unknown unknown space, exploratory research is fantastic. If your goal, on the other hand, is to make decisions, you need to be firmly in the quantitative space with a preference for causal research. But to be very clear, these things don't exist in isolation. Very often in a research program, you will have exploratory research, which will generate questions for you to answer. You'll then conduct quantitative research, which will answer some of those questions, but perhaps pose even new ones, leading you back into the exploratory phase, and then that cycle will continue. So your decision as a marketing researcher is to say, when do I stop? When do I have enough information to make a decision and move forward? And that is not an answer I can provide for you. It depends on how much certainty you need and how big that decision is. If the question is, do I put the picture on the left side or the right side? That's a small decision. You can make that with limited information. If the question is, do I open up a new product category in a different market that requires millions of dollars in investments? Yeah, you better get some better information and better data, and it better be quantitative in nature. Because the cost of making that mistake is gigantic. And so this brings us to the question of what type of research do we do? And that is going to be your assignment for this particular week. In Canvas, I'm going to pose a series of prompts asking you to identify what research approach of all the things that we've talked about across all these videos is likely to be the most appropriate given the question that I pose. You can work on your own or with a partner, and I have a strong preference that you work with a partner. We tend to work better when we work with others. Submit your response via Canvas. And in submitting your response, don't just tell me which option you choose, but give me a brief one or two sentence summary of why you think that particular approach is most appropriate. And we will be sure to discuss all of those in our next session that we meet together. Until then, have a great rest of your week.